Hi, my name is Nicole Moore, and today we are going to be creating vinyl purse straps with cotton fabric accents. Don't forget to subscribe and share this video. If you like anything that you see, please give us a thumbs up. You can find your cutting instructions at my website, somuchmore.com, and the link for you is in the description. To make vinyl lined handles, you'll fold your handle in half, wrong sides together, matching the long edges and press to make a center crease, and then open and fold each long edge to the center crease so the long raw edges are butting up against each other. You're going to press those down. Now on the vinyl piece, you'll draw a line down the center and then you will not be pressing the vinyl. That's really not a good idea. In fact, you'll probably ruin your vinyl and your iron if you do that. Instead, you're going to be folding towards the line that you've drawn and then use some clips just to put those in place. I would not recommend using any pins uh, because any puncture that you make into the vinyl will stay, it will not heal. So don't use pins to fold these down. Do this on both sides all along both edges. On the second side just fold that raw edge to the center crease. You're going to pin that or clip that all along that edge also. You're going to do this to both vinyl straps. Lots of clips. And then you're going to take it over to your sewing machine and you're going to sew the raw edge down on both sides. Let's go over there and I'll show you how that's done. You'll be making your stitching right along the raw edge, probably about a sixteenth of an inch if you want to be exact. I would just eyeball it. Do that on both sides. You're going to line that up as best as you can and sew the, the entire length of the strap on both sides. Once you've finished sewing both sides down, just inspect your work to make sure that you're happy with it. Now we're going to attach the top or the exterior fabric and you'll do wrong sides together. And then just line that up with the edge of the vinyl strap. And you're going to sew about an eighth of an inch away from the edge on each side. Just take your time. This is where your top stitching is going to matter. So use a slower speed and use as much control as you can at this point. your strap is finished. It's a really simple way to add a nice detail to a vinyl strap. I hope you make lots of these. Thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video tutorial. If you're looking for sewing tips and tricks and unique sewing projects, sign up for my weekly newsletter. This is where I share all the good stuff. Happy sewing! Thank you.